What's good, YouTube? It's Morgan TV, and I am back with another video for you guys. Today is a little bit different. I know y'all like what you doing. Right now, I'm in my car, and I'm in the Starbucks drive-thru. I'm about to order some Starbucks real quick. Um, I already ordered. I gotta pay. I'm in the Starbucks drive-thru, and I'm about to pick up my Starbucks right now. Film this little Q&A that I told you guys I was recording. I'm gonna try to find somewhere that's got some light, because it's not even that like, late. It's literally about like 5.30. And it's already dark outside, like it's getting dark really quick. So I'm about to find somewhere that has light, hopefully a parking lot or something like that. So I'm gonna pick up my drink and then I'm gonna hit y'all in. All right, so, so now that I set y'all up, I got my little drink right here and everything. If y'all wanna know what I got, I normally get the Como, uh, the Como River Crunch one, but this time I tried something different cause I really like this one. I got it like two times before. It's a sugar cookie almond one. It's like a Christmas special thing. I got some little sprinkles on the top and shit, whatever. This one I'm gonna be drinking on while we talking. Um, Anyways, you guys, now that y'all know what this video is about, I finally found somewhere to park. The angle is probably not the best because I got you guys on my dashboard, and my dashboard's got like a slanted thing to it. And really, I don't got nowhere else to put y'all except probably on the fucking floor or some shit. So, but I have been meaning to do this video for quite a minute now, I'm not gonna lie. It's been a few months since I posted on here. I apologize. I wish I could come on here and kind of tell you guys everything and kind of, you know, just be honest with you guys. But as of right now, I. I can't do that um I do want to say if you want to keep up with me on another you know you want to actually keep up with me rather than my YouTube channel you can go follow me on my Instagram snapchat I'm pretty I'm really I'm really active on my snapchat and sometimes my Instagram but mainly my snapchat so if you want to go add that you can keep up with me and what I got going on in my life and everything but on to what the video is actually about this is going to be a little Q&A video I asked a few questions a few weeks ago on my Instagram I posted on my story and you guys did not fail. Y'all came through with some pretty good questions. There were a few repetitive questions, so I'm gonna try to answer the ones that were not the same as all the others. I found a little bit of a better like angle for you guys. So, so I'm gonna go ahead and start answering the questions right now. The first question is business slash future plans. Future plans, I do plan on going to college and stuff after I graduate high school. And I want to actually if you guys don't know already, um, I talk about it all the time. If you know me, then you know. I do really want to open my own shoe store, open my own business and whatnot. Um, so I'm planning on going to college for something like that. Right now, I'm still trying to figure out exactly what I'm going to go for. But whatever helps me get there, A, the quickest and more, more, it's more effective. Like, I want it to be something that I'm actually going to use and need to get to where I want to be, if that makes sense. Second question was, I want to start off pretty slight. So, what's your favorite food? Personally, my favorite food is probably wings. I really like like chicken and shit. So probably wings. I like my wings boneless. Some people don't like boneless wings, but personally, I do. They just slap so much easier than eating the ones with the bones. It's just easier. But a lot, I know a lot of people are gonna hate me for that. But boneless wings are slap. I can't like I just can't. I love spicy stuff. I love spicy wings. It's just amazing. So spicy chicken wings, pretty much. Next question is how's life. I'm not gonna lie, man, lately life has been pretty hectic. But you know what, we all go through shit and at the end of the day, it's just gonna make us stronger. And I got my head on straight and I know what I wanna do with my life. And I feel like I'm really, uh, really good. I'm, I'm a really successful young person in my opinion. I feel like I've done really good for my age and I've gotten a lot of stuff accomplished that I really wanted to get accomplished. And I feel like I have a good mindset. Um, I deal with a lot of shit on my own, my own personal life that I don't talk about on here. but. That doesn't affect like what I want to do with my life and what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm still making moves. I'm still climbing up the ladder. But I'm st I'm out I'm also mentally. I may not be completely okay, but you know what? It's cool because we're gonna make it through at the end. It doesn't really matter. My, that's the answer to your question. How's life? It's been pretty shitty. I'm not gonna lie. But you know what? We're gonna make it in the end. Everything's gonna be okay. So that's the answer to that question. Next one. Um, this is actually from my sister. Is when when are you coming to ATL? That's a good question. I don't really, I don't know, to be honest. I really don't know. Right now, I don't see myself really going anywhere because I have a lot of stuff I'm trying to, you know, take care of right now. But when I get to that level where I can, you know, start traveling and stuff and have my shit together, then I will probably visit, you know. Um, but, you know, whenever I can, I probably will. Um, 
another question that was kind of similar to how's life and just how you doing like i said pretty shitty but you know what we're gonna get through it this one was for somebody else that says what do you want your life to be like in five to ten years very good question um in five years that's more of a short term in five years i see myself graduated high school obviously i see myself in college hopefully moved out somewhere on my own living um either on my own or with whoever i'm with at the time just i want to be moved out and on my own by them in about 10 years i see myself like probably done with college i won't spend 10 years in college but done with college i'm succeeding in life doing everything that i've been wanting to do i see myself finally opening up my future shoe store that's my dream my biggest dream um and i really want to accomplish that so in 10 years i can see myself in my future shoe store just doing amazing having living the best life that i possibly can and doing what i love to do and hopefully i get to live out that dream um like i said that's the only thing i want to do like for i'm really passionate about it so i can see myself doing that in 10 years another one is how long you and your girl been together me and my girlfriend we've been together for almost a year now we'll be a year on valentine's day um so quite a bit it's honestly it flew by quick as fuck man but we got a long ways to go next question is do you want to move to a different state that's a very good question also i do want to move to a different state yes i first though before i start moving and shit as you know if you watch me you probably know and if you don't i live in north carolina i've been in north carolina my entire life pretty much i don't really get to travel a lot my family was never really the traveling type so i never really got to explore many places but me being me i love to travel i love experiencing new things like i'm just a crazy ass person and i would love to go out here and explore the whole world so i do really want to travel deeply so i do want to travel first when i'm done with college and i get my shit together i eventually start traveling and then from traveling i can pick where i'd want to move from that experience i just really want to make sure wherever i move to i'm going to be happy successful and it's going to be a good environment for me all the way around that's my answer to that question i'm gonna travel first a hell of different places and then wherever i like the most that's where i'm gonna end up going this one is from yours truly my girlfriend um what's your favorite thing about you? she asked me what's my favorite thing about her i think my favorite thing about my girlfriend is probably probably her mindset she's got a really unique mindset i feel like she's the type of person where you have a conversation with her and you ask her how she feels about a certain subject and she'll answer and she'll say some off the wall shit that'll change her perspective at the same time like i could be like yeah this happened i feel strongly about it blah 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 and she'll be like yeah but look at it this way you know what i'm saying like she's really fucking smart she's really smart and she's got a really good mindset too she's like a positive person that like she's uplifting she's sweet as fuck man she's got a good ass mindset mind, mindset and all the way around i just like how she thinks she's really like she's really open-minded like she's not a closed-minded person at all bro when i tell you she thinks from every fucking aspect she thinks from every aspect like she's not closed-minded at all and i really like that about her because it's a lot it always keeps shit interesting you know what i'm saying and i feel like i learned stuff constantly being with her because she's just so intelligent in so many things honestly that's probably my favorite thing about you for real another question from somebody that actually texted me on my instagram asked me where i've been at and i get this question kind of a lot people have been texting me telling me i need to post and everything i've been going through a lot of shit on my own moving around different places and stuff so i've kind of been a little a bit of everywhere mainly i've been working working my ass off i just want to say thank you to everybody who's been supporting me so much also i have something else to show you guys so let's get into it also i have one more thing to show you guys let's see a few videos ago i filmed a video of like my hat collection and stuff and back then i had bought like hella hats just like in bulk i really didn't wear them like that i just collected them and i bought hella hats and they didn't even really fit me right but bro i didn't even know like i didn't know because i didn't really wear them so i didn't really pay attention to it so i have all of these hats right here that do not fit they're like a little bit too big like they fit but they're a little too big so i am looking to sell these if you guys are interested in any of these hats you can hit me up on instagram or snapchat and i will be happy as hell to send these to you pretty much all brand new they just been sitting in my room for a long ass time they're all size 7 1 4th 
they're literally all that size like i said i have not worn these hats not once i have literally just tried them on a few times and like made videos with them but i have not worn them like i said these are all brand new and even these have like tags on them as you can see down here they have the price tag on them and everything i do not wear these like they're still straight brim and everything but they got the tags on them and everything brand new like exactly i don't i don't wear these shits i love these fucking hats that's why i bought them but unfortunately they're not in my size so i do have to sell them i have this really nice ass fucking green one that i wish i fit jesus christ i wish i fit this whole this shit is so clean look at the tag and everything on it you feel me so brand new don't even wear this bitch like that but this was for sale also then i had this la dodgers one i tried this one on and i also put this patch on it myself uh, um, I put that patch on it myself right there to add a little bit of flavor to it. But other than that, I have never worn this one either. Um, this is 714. It got the black brim, but you know what? It's still nice. Then this one is like my most recent one that I got. Um, I do not want to sell this one. But I'm going I'm to get it again. In this, and I'm going to get it again, but I'm going to get it in the right size this time. But this one is my favorite. It's the LA black hat. And it's got the little gray brim underneath. And it's got a palm tree on it. And on the back, it's got a little taco. I did not put these on there myself. They came like that. So, yeah, that's how you know this bitch nice to look at it. I really love this hat, like I said. But it was actually a gift to me from my girlfriend. But, obviously, I told her the wrong size. Because it was when I used when I was just collecting them. I didn't really know my size. All four of these hats are for sale. So, if you guys want them, please let me know. And I'll be happy to send them to you. But, yeah, that's going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button. And then turn on post notifications. So, you're notified every single time that I upload a new banger. Because you wouldn't want to miss it. I'm trying to tell you. Like I said, if you want the hats, hit me up. Make sure you guys leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see. Whatever. Stay tuned for another video soon coming out. Give me some ideas. And I'll film it for you. No problem. Yeah. It's Morgan TV. And I'm out.